Hello and welcome back to the KSP career with me and today we will be doing the Starship Gojira orbital test so a full stack rocket going into the heavens after I have auto strutted it as you saw from the previous episode it was dancing all over the place if you haven't watched it do check it out it's pretty cool previous episode we did obviously the high altitude tests and in this one we will be doing the orbital full stack and I'd like to imagine this one as being the 4 booster 4 and Starship 20 which we now know it they will never fly so this is a sort of you know homage to the craft that should have had great you know uh, history however it has served its purpose so as a test vehicle for refueling stacking and destacking so we will be we, it's loaded with liquid methane and we have a lot of thrust to weight and delta v in this stage so honestly guys i have no idea how it looks how it performs but i know that because of the gojira being deprecated in tundra industries this is actually the first and the last full stack orbital flight and I will be changing the mod to the Starship Extended which will be coming from the future episodes and there we will obviously have to do another high altitude test and also the full stack orbit just to see how it performs and I'm really curious to see. However, this one was considered it as a mini bonus episode where we actually get a chance to see how would the Gojira perform? Yeah, I'm a big fan of the Tundra Industries, you know, however, now the design of both Starship and the Super Heavy are outdated and they don't look as they should. And I don't have the grid fins, so I will be running the Super Heavy in the expendable mode, sorry about that. I don't have the grid fins, so... But the Starship, I will attempt free entry and see how it goes. So, there we go. Look at it go. With three RVAX running and we will be... Oh, this is this is a screenshot for the episode if I ever knew one. Amazing. Beautiful. Now, what I want to see is Starship circular, circularizing. By the way, do guys, if you do like these kind of content, do smash the like button. It helps me out a great deal. Anyway... Uh, the one thing that actually worries me, I have put in the full fuel load of liquid methane for the Starship. It could be a little bit problematic because I'm not going with it anywhere. So, yeah, maybe I should have gone to Mars or something like that. I don't know. Anyway, what I plan to do with it, it just, was just to reach orbit and then I will be going back. But it has a total of a whopping 3.8 thousand so i'm actually just swapping the engines i'm just checking out what my thrust to weight is and what my you know delta v is using those so i'm gonna go for a deorbit burn and i want to deorbit somewhere in the shade area so in the you know on the night side so that the re-entry is seen on the light side because this is a test of you know going up and then going down there we go so Let's just quickly jump over to that area. There we go. All right, now performing the deorbit burn, and then we shall be. Uh, then we shall be going into the atmosphere. Yeah, that's the idea. So there we go. Come on, let's turn the ship orbit prograde. And once we come to the sunny side, we shall be enabling, we have enabled the flaps, set the camera angle correct, and now let's enjoy the re-entry as it occurs. I'm really, I have never tested how basically we should be, you know, Let's extend the flaps. The thing is, I have forgotten to put this on the action group once I have rebuilt the orbital starship because I needed to put a different type of wings. So, yeah. Or flaps. The, I'm not sure if you can call these things wings, technically. 
Anyway, let's see how do we approach re-entry. This is the first time I'm doing an orbital re-entry, so don't judge me if it goes south. Well, technically we're going east, but you know what I mean. All right, so there we go, re-entering. Ooh, a hot plasma coming in. Uh-oh, don't flip, don't flip, don't flip. Come on. Yeah, technically, guys, I think I'm gonna try to... Oh, come on. There you go. Oh, that's nice. Oh, no, 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 not reverse, not reverse. Come on. Oh, flip, flip. Yes, no. Oh, boy. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure that the real Starship will not have such a trajectory. However, okay, let's fire up the engines. Let's, you know, reduce our orbital velocity. Come on. Uh-oh. Uh, yeah. Uh, mm. Right. When I thought extendable and, well, at least we're blending the payload. So hopefully that will work too. Okay. So, yeah, I'm opening. Oh, look at this. Aha. I can fly. See? Yep, yep. All right, guys, so you know what to do. Smash that like button, and I will be seeing you in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching. This is Gromforks, signing off.